did I hear this correctly? That they discharged a four-year-old little boy with leukemia from the Ronald McDonald House because he didn't have a vaccination. If this is true, that is appalling. I don't understand the kind of thinking that I've been seeing here lately. A four-year-old little boy? I mean, for goodness sakes, people created uh, smoking sections and non-smoking sections. Why cannot, why can people not make a non-vaccinated area versus a vaccinated area? Really, I, I, I don't understand this. I thought the main purpose of the Ronald McDonald houses was to take care of sick children with, with life-threatening diseases and conditions. And now I hear that they kicked out a four-year-old boy with leukemia because he wasn't vaccinated. Really, if this sets good with anybody out there and you're connected to me, I don't want you to be connected to me. You know, there's just something very wrong about that. Very wrong. If anybody thinks that that is okay, then that's a problem. Because it's not. I mean, look, they have made it a point uh, to separate smokers from non-smokers. And they did it with ease. Now smokers go over here, non-smokers go over there. Why can I not do that with the vaccinated and the unvaccinated? If they don't want to do it, okay, you go to the unvaccinated area. But a four-year-old boy got kicked out of the Ron McDonald house. I just can't get past this. This is just so, I mean, this place is, is, is ran by donations. Did they talk to all the donors and say, hey, we have this unvaccinated child. We want to let him out because, you know, he's unvaccinated. Did they ask the donors who give him their funding if that was okay with them? I'm just asking because it's not right. It's not. If I donated money there, I would say, of course not. No, he's sick. He's got leukemia. You make it so he can be there. If you're so worried, put another ward out. You get the money. You got the funding. You use your resources to help these children. You don't use your resources to push people out. You've got to make it so... He can be there and still get the care he needs. He wouldn't be there if his family could afford all the things that he's going to have to have done. Right? For the life of me, it's getting harder and harder for me to embrace people. I have friends that are vaccinated. I have friends that are unvaccinated. We love each other. We come together, we talk, we, we dine, we chit chat, we, we have wine together. We love each other and we accept each other. Why can't we all be this way? We had a child here that was in hospital, it was on life support and it was heartbreaking, you know, that the parents couldn't do anything to save their child. Because of rules and laws. A rule and a law isn't good if it's only meant to isolate and abandon and push away. It's, it's just not. We're not going to get rid of this. It's going to be here. So... Live, let's live and 
Stop doing terrible things like that to a four-year-old. Really. I don't want to be here with people that think like this. I don't. I don't want to think that my world is like this.